OpenAI's ChatGPT has helped popularize the concept of LLMs, such as the GPT, the Generative Pre-Trained Transformer model, and the possibility of transforming a text prompt or input into an output. Microsoft has unveiled Cosmos 2, which it describes as a multimodal, large language model that can not only respond to language prompts, but also visual cues, which can be used for an array of tasks, including image captioning, visual question answering, and more. How Microsoft Research is Advancing the State of Art in AI For 30 years, Microsoft Research has been at the forefront of advancing the foundations of computing and translating new scientific understanding into innovative technologies to create value for Microsoft customers and broad benefit to society. Microsoft has been a pioneer delivering cutting-edge AI breakthroughs in vision, speech, language, decision-making, and machine learning including conversational speech recognition, machine translation, image captioning, and common sense question answers, and then translating these breakthroughs into products to help Microsoft customers. And one such product is the Microsoft Cosmos. Now let's take an in-depth look at Cosmos 2. Have you heard of Cosmos 2? A new model for multimodal AI. It can perceive and generate content across text, images, and videos, and perform tasks like phrase grounding, referring expression comprehension, and video question answering. Cosmos 2, a new AI model that lays the foundation for embodiment AI, Microsoft's Cosmos 2 is the embodiment AI prototype. Maybe this is the first time you've heard about embodiment AI. Well, the name is pretty suggestive in itself. Microsoft has been putting a lot of budget into funding AI research lately. Orca 13b is open source to the public after a team of researchers assembled and funded by Microsoft built-in PH1, a new language model for coding, is capable of learning and developing knowledge on its own. Microsoft funded the research for it and it seems embodiment AI is the next quest in AI development. But Microsoft might just have the answer with another research on AI. This time it's about embodiment AI. So what is Embodiment AI, you might ask? Embodiment AI is a field of artificial intelligence that focuses on the development of intelligent agents that have a physical body and can interact with the world in a meaningful way. The concept is based on the idea that the physical body plays a significant role in how an agent learns and makes decisions. In other words, if AI would have a body and would move, then it could learn from this and respond and form answers, as well as interact accordingly. And if you think we enter science fiction territory, hold your ground. AI was always supposed to become physical. According to the research, Cosmos 2 is a language model that enables new capabilities of perceiving object descriptions, for example, bounding boxes, and grounding text to the visual world. The researchers represented expressions as links in Markdown, for example, text span, where object descriptions are sequences of location tokens. Together with multimodal corpora, they constructed large-scale data of grounded image text pairs, called GRID, to train the model. In addition to integrating the existing capabilities of MLLMs in Cosmos 2, the model also integrates the grounding capability into applications. This means the language has taken steps forward in perceiving space and coming up with its own perception, action, and world modeling. The researchers think this way, Cosmos 2 is the foundation for a physical AI. What is multimodal AI? Multimodal AI is a type of artificial intelligence that merges different kinds of data like text, images, videos, and sounds. Its aim is to build AI systems that can understand and create content from various sources, much like humans do. In the past, AI systems could only manage one type of data at a time. However, with the creation of multimodal large language models, MLLMs, they can work with multiple types of data at once and generate mixed content. The evolution from Cosmos 1 to Cosmos 2 Microsoft unveiled Cosmos 1 last year, a groundbreaking multimodal language model trained on large-scale web data containing text, images, and their combinations. It excelled at tasks like writing stories from images, creating image captions, and answering questions about images. However, Cosmos 1 had its limitations, particularly in understanding and connecting visual information to illustrate. Cosmos 2, the latest version of Microsoft's MLLM, introduces a feature called grounding. This feature allows Cosmos 2 to interact with images more accurately and meaningfully, using words or coordinates to refer to specific parts of an image. This makes Cosmos 2 more dynamic and precise than other machine learning language models, enabling more human-like interaction. Okay, now let's understand more about Cosmos 2. What is Microsoft Cosmos 2? 
Microsoft Cosmos 2 is a multimodal, large language model that can understand and chat about images as we do. It is trained on huge data sets of text and images, and it can link words and pictures together in a cool way. Unlike traditional AI systems that focus on a single modality, Cosmos 2 has the unique ability to comprehend and interpret data from multiple sources, providing a more holistic understanding of the world. Enhanced Natural Language Processing One of the key strengths of Cosmos 2 lies in its enhanced natural language processing capabilities. It can analyze and interpret text with exceptional accuracy, allowing users to communicate with the system in a more conversational manner. Whether it's answering complex questions, providing detailed explanations, or engaging in meaningful dialogue, Cosmos 2's NLP capabilities enable it to comprehend and respond to human language with remarkable precision. Advanced Computer Vision In addition to its language processing abilities, Cosmos 2 also incorporates advanced computer vision technology. It can analyze and interpret visual information, such as images and videos, with impressive accuracy. This opens up a wide range of applications, from image recognition and object detection to visual search and augmented reality experiences. By integrating computer vision into its multimodal framework, Cosmos 2 brings a new level of visual understanding to AI systems. Speech recognition and synthesis. Cosmos 2 further extends its capabilities with state-of-the-art speech recognition and synthesis. It can accurately transcribe spoken words and convert them into text, enabling seamless voice interactions with the system. Additionally, Cosmos 2's speech synthesis capabilities allow it to generate natural-sounding human-like speech, enhancing the user experience and making interactions with the AI system more engaging and intuitive. Contextual Understanding and Personalization What sets Cosmos 2 apart is its ability to understand context and personalize interactions. By considering information from multiple modalities, including text, images, and speech, Cosmos 2 can grasp the nuances and context of conversations more effectively. This contextual understanding enables it to provide more accurate and relevant responses, tailoring the user experience to individual preferences and needs. The Benefits of Microsoft Cosmos 2 They can understand object descriptions, for example, bounding boxes, and ground text to the visual world. This means that it can understand the relationship between text and images and use this understanding to answer questions about images, generate referring expressions, and perform other perception language tasks. It can generate referring expressions and phrases that describe objects in an image. That's interesting. While we can't say with certainty how the job market will be impacted by AI, we are committed to help people in understanding AI and its impact on society. I hope you all liked this video. Well, do let us know your views on Microsoft's Cosmos 2, and don't forget to subscribe to our channel and turn on the post notifications to stay updated. Until next time, stay happy, stay healthy, and I'll see you all.